Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ4 Ray, and welcome back to Supermarket Simulator. So when you're right, guys, you're right. And you were totally right about this. Uh, get the mirrored registers and have everyone facing the front of the store. Makes a ton of sense. I'm glad I did it. I went ahead and sold all of my old registers, and we now have mirrored registers. Now, this is going to take... This is going to take some getting used to. Uh, you guys gotta understand, I've rung up thousands of people, literally over a thousand people, because I need, they need like 900 or something to get your fourth register worker. So, for me to ring up backwards like this is, is weird, man. It's freaking weird. <laughs> I'm just, uh, <laughs> I didn't even think about it. Alright, Dapper Dan, thank you for the exact change, but I will work it out. It's gonna be awesome, we're gonna be making some real money. I wish the customers would come through here and go out the proper way, though. Like, the whole idea of setting this up like this is so they would do that. And they're not doing it. But I guess it's fine. Uh, One dollar is your change. Have a nice day. What's up, my man? How's it going? All right. We need to make some money today. Why don't you make some money? Well, I think I need about $65,000 for the next store expansion. Am I going to get it today? I don't know. I don't know. Remember I said I was up till 1 o'clock in the morning last night with that video? Yeah, it wasn't 1 o'clock in the morning. I was so tired. I wasn't, like, thinking, and it was really 2 o'clock in the morning. When I went upstairs, um, I was like, oh, is it really 2.30? And she's like, yeah, it's 2.30. I was like, oh, my goodness, what is going on? Um, actually, I think I got up by 3. It wasn't even 2.30. It took me an hour of editing um, and setting up videos and stuff. So I went upstairs, and I was like, is it really 3 o'clock? And she's like, yeah, it's 3 o'clock. So I got to bed around 5, 5 in the morning. Now, here's the thing. I'm going to bed at 5 in the morning, and my cat is meowing like crazy. Sylvie, the cute one. I mean, they're both cute, but Sylvie's really cute. And she's just sitting there doing her little girly, because she's a female, she's doing a little girly meow. And I was like, oh, that's so cute. So I got up, and she's in the, she's literally in the shower, like, looking at the wall. And I'm like, what is the matter with you? So I was petting her, and she was, she was purring and having a good time. And now it's like 5.30, and I'm like, I really got to go to bed. So I went to bed. So then she decides, I'm just starting to fall asleep. I might have just started snoring. And she gets on my pillow and sits on my head. And now it's like six. And then she, I, I go to bed again. And I'm like just about to fall asleep. She does it again. So I had to put her out and close the door. And I hate doing that. Um, but I had to. It was like I didn't get to bed till seven in the morning. Um, you know, partially because of the video. Partially because of my crazy cat. Uh, <laughs> so it, is, it was a rough day for me yesterday. For sure. And um, yeah. But you know what? Playing this game is awesome. I love this game. I love the fact that you love this game. Last, yesterday's video did fantastic. So that makes me very happy. I mean, that's that's win. That's a win-win. I could, you know, I could sleep later. I can catch up on my sleep. It's not that big of a deal. When I was young, I'd pull some all-nighters sometimes, you know? Like, um, I'd have to get up at 3 o'clock in the morning. I got up around 3 o'clock in the morning for the better part of my life because I used to bake bagels. So I would get up at 3 o'clock in the morning go to work. Later on, I got a job at a train station kiosk, which meant I could get up at, like, 4. I got to sleep in. It was awesome. Uh, and just like a year ago is when I started, like, doing YouTube full-time. So now I could just sleep whenever the heck I want. But, yeah, for most of my... I mean, we're talking, like, 25 years of getting up at, like, 4 or 3 in the morning. And sometimes when I was a kid, I'd be like, eh, I'm just gonna play video games throughout the entire night and then just get up and go to work and I could sleep when I get home. And, um, yeah, that was... That was a crazy time. Can't do that anymore, though. Because I'm, I'm, like, I'm old. I need to sleep. So, um, you know. So when I stay up that late, it's just... It, it was rough. It was a rough night. It was a fun night, though. I look back on those nights, and I'm like, yeah, man, that was that was a good time. That was a good time. You guys love the video, too, so it's win-win. It's anyway, um, yeah, so we need to make $65,000. We'll see if I can do it today. I'm not really sure. It just depends on how much ordering we're going to do. How's it going, lady? All right, pizza and chips. Cool. Have a nice day. Hello. Hello. I don't know why I said it like that. Uh, it's weird, though. Like, this whole backwards thing, it seems... It seems to feel better. I don't really know why. I'm 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 at. I am at 28, 23, 22 frames a second, and it kind of feels smooth. Like it feels like I'm at like 40 or 50. So I'm not really sure what's up with that, uh, but it's making the ringing up very smooth, and I, I kind of like ringing up from this angle. I'm not gonna lie. I wasn't I wasn't like sure at first, but hey, look, it's Psycho Sid. That guy's going to brush his teeth when he gets home. Good man. Dental hygiene is important. Psycho Sid, what's up, bro? How's it going? Ah, it's good to hear. Good to hear. Uh, 4150. Have a nice day. What's up, Tara? All right. Sounds good. There we go. Cool, cool. Uh, 375. Have a nice day. 
I don't have a name for this guy. What's up, John Doe? Uh, 75, have a good one. Hello? Hello? Why am I talking like that tonight? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, let's see. You guys will be happy to know that I got to exercise today. <clears throat> I've been exercising recently. And last week I couldn't exercise because my, there's something wrong with my ankle. And, I don't know, it just went away. So, um, I did get to exercise today and that was really good. And, uh, that made me happy. Usually does. Not just... Not just because I'm doing something I know is good for me, but it just it feels physically good, you know? What's going on, bro? There's two ways I exercise. One is I go on the cross trainer. I have a cross trainer at my house. And the second one is automatically I go to walk to the park. Now, the cross trainer is like 20 minutes of, you know, pretty strenuous exercise. Uh, it makes me sweat, gets my heart rate up, I'm breathing heavy, all that good stuff. The walk to the park, I really don't breathe that heavy, and I don't really sweat. But it's, um, it's not 20 minutes, it's like a half hour, maybe 40 minutes at the most. So they're both good, you know, different ways to exercise and everything. All right, do we have room for these veggies yet? Yes, we do. I bought us some extra veggies because I wasn't paying attention. That was on me. Let's see, about, let's check out the spaghetti. Oh, come on, really? The way, am I charging too much for the spaghetti or what? what what's going on? What's going, where is it? Where's the spaghetti? There it is. Ah, what am I charging for this? No one's buying it. It's not that bad. Buy it, people. You better buy it. You're going to be in trouble. Buy the spaghetti. You're all banned. Let's do that. I don't know about this, uh, this ice cream. Let's check out this ice cream really quick. Nope. All right. I guess I got to give more than a day for things to get, you know, fleshed out through here. I only have four boxes outside the... I had like 50 boxes out here at one point. It was, it was, it was mayhem. Plus the cool thing about being at this register is if I want, I can just grab some booze and get back to the register. Who's going to say anything to me? I'm the boss. Like, what are you going to say? Like, nobody's going to say anything to me. Okay. Looking good. All right. I am going to have to order some stuff, but first let's see how we did. Okay, zero. By the way, product the, one person got it. I've I've only read the comments up to this point, and it is 9:30 p.m. Tuesday, April 2nd. So if anyone says it after that, um, Central Time, by the way. If anyone says it after that, I haven't seen it, but I did see one person in the comments say what was missing, and it was muscle milk, and that was the only thing that was missing. So um, ABC book, sliced bread, mashed potatoes. ABC book, that's white. It's a white book. Here it is. Um, sliced bread, mashed potatoes. Sliced bread, mashed potatoes. You know what? I'm going to leave that. Nah, let's go to 650. I want these to sell because they have a good, you know, a good profit margin. Um, what did I say? Mashed potatoes and 506. Huh? Let's go with 525. 525. Cool, cool. And darn it. I don't remember the last thing. It, it's right on the top tip of my brain, but I can't remember what it was. You know, it's funny, like, I, when I'm not, like, recording, I can remember all of the stuff, like, easily. Oh, sliced bread. But it's just when I'm recording, I'm trying to think about interesting stuff to say it uses up a bit of my brain power, and that just pushes everything else out. All right, $6 for that. That looks good. Let's go, let's go and open up, just have back-to-back -back days. Let's do it. And while I'm waiting for people to come in, I will order more stuff. So we need cleaning products. All right here, we need four of these, four of these, and we'll finish it up with two of these. We, oh, okay, a lot of toilet paper. All right, so we need red toilet paper and paper towels. Paper. Red toilet paper, four and three paper towels. Three paper towels. Cool, cool. And now let's get... Got toothpaste up there. That's good. This is looking good. Oh, okay. So we need red and... I don't know what to call that. Red and... Ah, darn it. I was looking at the sugars. I'm trying to think of an easy way to remember the sugars, but... It doesn't work. I'm not, I'm not good with the sugars. A lot of stuff I can remember. Like green, you know, or not green, but like, remember, blue coffee, red coffee, black coffee. Um, the cereals are orange, white, and black. Um, that's how I remember stuff. Uh... 
So, I know what sugars I need, though, I remember. So, it doesn't really matter. Sugar. And we'll just get two of these and one of these. Okay. Let's stop bringing that stuff away from our customers. Uh, this is there. Hold on. I'm a coming. Hey, what's going on? You got food for your puppers. I love it. Have a nice day. Going on four eyes. Register one's open. Actually, am I register one anymore? How do they do registers? I don't think so. I think one, two, three, four. Register four is open. Hold on. I've got to adjust in my chair. Yo, Steve Austin. What's up, bro? Uh, nobody's coming to my register. What a bunch of dinks. Okay. And that's going to go right there. Oops. There. And let's get on out there. I knew as soon as I walked away, some jerk was going to come up to my register. All right. And 50 cents. Have a nice day. Let's go, man. Oh, is this a jacked guy? Oh, okay. Some people give me names for the jack guy, but I don't remember what they were. 15, 16, 17, 50. Have it going. Okay, let's bring this in and continue bringing people up. Man, I'm at $45,000 already. Uh, now, I do have some stuff to order back here. But yeah, I mean, I think we're going to get to that $65,000 today, guys. I really do. I think we're going to see a store expansion, which is just absolutely phenomenal. Let's see how this day went. All right, so we didn't find something. That might have just been them running out normally of something. Um, I don't know. It could have been the milk. I don't have a lot of milk out there yet. Uh, but I did make $11,600. And lay cleaner, lay cleaner, lay cleaner. That's... Mm, oh, is that th this one? Yep. Okay. I always get confused with something. You know, I, I kind of like that price. We're going to leave it where it is. So what about the milk? Yeah, I don't know if it was the milk. Um, I am leaving the uh, the dog food uh, out in the back. I don't know what we've actually ran out of. Uh, I don't think it was anything we ran out of in the back. They just might not have kept up. I'm going to have to keep an eye on that. Anyway, uh, yeah, let, this is what we're going to do now. This is what we're going to do now. I think I got a bunch of stuff here. Let's just go ahead and order that. And then we're going to order food. And, yep, we're going to get two of these. Uh, yeah, two of those will be fine. And then, what was it, blue? Yeah, we need the blue cat food. Four of these. And then I just need to kind of fill that up with some other stuff. Uh, yeah, blue rice. Let's get some rice. Blue rice, and we'll get four of that. All right, cool. So now what I'm going to do with the dog food is I'm going to clear out the rest of that rack, and I'm going to put the... the then we'll have a spot for milk properly. Um, I was using extra dog food on this rack, but I really need it for... I really need it for the milk, so... Uh, let's go ahead and fill that up, and then empty this. And we're good to go before we do anything else. Grab some milk. Bada bing, bada boom, Bob's your uncle, and we're good to go. So I am gonna have to order some more stuff. So let me order a few things. Let me give my let me give my peeps here a chance to you know uh, stock the shelves, and then we're gonna do another day. And uh, we're we're getting really close to that sixty five thousand. It just depends on how much I'm gonna have to order. If I have to order a ton of stuff, then it might we might not make it today. But um, I'm gonna try my best. As of right now, I think we're gonna make it today. But you never know. Man, I was well above $50,000 for a while, but then I had to, like, restock back here. And then I dropped down pretty low. Um, and now I'm back up to 46000 It's looking pretty good here. I think we could probably run another day, which is awesome. And I'm going to have to go fight. It costs me $100 every time I want to... <laughs> every time I want to ring people up, because i got to fire the fourth, ca fourth cashier and then rehire them uh, the next day. Although I guess I don't have to pay him for $80 for that day. So, yeah. Okay, great. Let's go ahead and open up. Let's see if we could, if we could run a couple days. You make about if we could run a couple days. Forty, fifty. Uh, actually, if we could run two days without having to buy anything. Oh crap! I forgot the bills. All right, hold on. Oh, that thought. There we go. All right. So let's say we run two more days. We make ten thousand dollars each day. That's forty-four, uh, fifty-four. Wait, two days. Yeah, twenty. 44, 54, 64. I think in two days, if we don't have to buy anything else for the back, we can get the expansion. Now, here's the deal. Here's the deal. 
we're going to want to, I really want to continue buying product for the back because when you don't buy product for the back, this gets really, really empty. And then it takes me a long time to get this back up to where it's, you know, it's pretty stocked. Um, as a matter of fact, let's go ahead. We are going to have to get some rice. I have no choice. So this will be the last thing I buy and we'll see. I, I can always take out a loan too if I want to. It's not really that big of a deal. So I think we're going to let the back get uh, low and we're just going to go two, two days and not worry about anything and just not buy anything as I'm buying rice. I, rice is pretty cheap though. It, it's I'm still at 44,000. So I'm going to try not to buy anything. I'm going to try and get close to that 65,000, probably take out a loan. And I think in two more days, we will be able to get our next store expansion. I think the store expansions are going to be four at a time now. I believe someone was telling me that because I thought there were going to be three store expansions at a time. What I mean by at a time is when you get chunks of store expansions, they come and like they dis they make your they make the inside of your uh, supermarket very like awkward because they're just little cubby holes. And eventually, when you get all of them along a row, boom, your store is back being square again. And that's where I like my store. So I think somebody said you buy four and then five. So one, two, three, four. That will be a square store. And then one, two, three, four, five. And that'll be another square store. You know what? That makes sense. I'm pretty sure that's the way it's going to work. Although I, I don't. I'm kind of sure. I think I know how that's going to work. But I don't know 100%. Um, and we still got to be store level 99 before we can even get that last expansion. So let's go ahead and bang this out. I think I checked it. I think I was like... I think I'm coming up on like 140 hours in this game, which is um, pretty nuts. Pretty nuts. Hey, what's going on, guys? All right. $51. There you go. Have a good day. What's up, Tara? How are you doing this fine day? All right. Very good. Uh, 40. It's not exact change, but it's pretty good change. Easy change. I like it. Have a nice day. And let's bring this in. Right, I'm not. I'm not spending other money. I'll let it get low. I'll let it get low. What are you gonna do? Sometimes you just gotta let the product get low and save some money. Because if I keep right now, it would take two days, and the 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 storage area in the back would be a little on the bare side. It's gonna be pretty low. But if I if I buy stuff for the back, it's gonna take another four days, and um, I'd rather get in two days and four. And uh, I'll just take some time tomorrow and, uh, you know, do some stocking before I make the next video. Let's say Tuesday. Oh, I'm streaming tomorrow. Okay. All right. Yeah, that's right. Wednesday. Okay. Well, actually, this is going up on Wednesday. So just so you guys know, I'll be streaming this tonight. <laughs> 6 p.m. Central Time. Be there or be square. Oh, my goodness. Ah, oh, boy. I need some, I need some sleep. Man. I'm tired tonight. It's weird. I'm actually kind of tired, and I'm, I think it's because of the exercise since I worked out today for the first time in a, in a couple weeks. And, uh, yeah, uh, when I work out, it does make me tired, which is good. It's going to make me sleep better tonight. And that is really good because um, I've, I've had sleep issues a lot in my life because, like, I was mentioning earlier, you know, i got to be up at 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock in the morning back when I was working. And when you got to be up at, like, 3 o'clock in the morning, you got to go to bed by, like, like honestly, I'd be laying down by 6, asleep by 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3. That's 8 hours. So if you want a full 8 hours, you got to be asleep by 7. That's very difficult. At one point, I was taking, like, NyQuil. Like, way too much. Way too much. So, just trying to get to sleep. My wife has these little, um, these little vitamin thingies. Uh, they have serotonin or something. I'm not sure if that's the right word. But it's, like, some kind of sleep aid. And, uh, she doesn't have to take them often, but she takes them here and there when she needs them. Probably better than taking NyQuil. <laughs> NyQuil. Whew. I was never sick, though. <laughs> All right. Come on. Lane 4 is open. Hey, lane 4 is open. Are we out of something? Someone was over here. It might have been too expensive. All right. Hopefully it was something too expensive. Uh, the milk isn't looking too good. Well, we're going to have to buy some of that. If I don't buy the milk, it's going to run out. So I have to decide if that's worth it or not. Yeah, I'll probably buy some milk. It's really going to put me behind. I really don't want to have to do through. All right, you know what? You know what? That's not bad. I'm going to tell you why. He only bought one item. But the thing is, he bought a book, which is, uh, you know, twelve fifty isn't a ton of money. But the profit margin on books is very high. So I will be fine with that. 
375. Have a good day. Hello, Mr. Anderson. Damn, this guy's buying a lot of money. Or buying a lot of money? What the hell are you talking about, Cage? He's buying a lot of stuff. 282. I guess money doesn't really, really mean a lot to the agents because they're part of the system. They just get, you know, like print money or whatever. Go. Looking good. 180. 75. Have a nice day. How's it going, boss? All right, very good. 5350. Have a nice day. All right, a lot of kegs. I want to get a keg. I, I like the idea of having a keg. Do you think they they would make kegs for like soda? I think they should make kegs for soda. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna I guess that's a two liter bottle. I don't know. I wanted a keg though. I want a keg with Diet Pepsi in it, and I could just get those little red cups, and then have the little the little nozzle thing, and then I could drink it right out of the keg, like into the, the little red cups. That would be freaking dope. Uh, 70, oh, come on. 75, 6, 7, 50. Have a nice day. All right, I got a line. That's not good. KJ40 shouldn't have a line. He's too fast. Uh, 139, 75. Have a nice day. So what's everybody's store level? Let me know in the comments. And don't just put the number because I won't remember what I asked you. I'll just see a lot of people saying, like, their numbers and, like, I'll be like, what, what did I ask? Say my store level is, and, um... You know, let me know because I'm kind of curious. I do that a lot. I'll ask people something and then they'll answer me and I'll be like, I don't know what the heck they're talking about. I don't remember. I think I asked them something, but now I don't remember what it was. How's it going, boss? All right. Looking good. Uh, 325. Have a nice day. Hey, how's it going? Getting some bleach, some beer. Going to do some laundry. Exact change. Love it. Have a good one. Really wish these people would go out the proper way. It's just it's always gonna bother me. It's so not an issue though. Uh, two forty-seven twenty-five. Have a nice day. By the way, there was an update like a couple days ago, or maybe yesterday. I don't know. A couple days ago. Uh, the reason I didn't talk about it was because it was mostly quality. Like it wasn't even quality of life stuff, honestly. It was mostly just um, like bug fixes and stuff. And uh, I think I showed like we got we now have a um, a field of view slider. As a matter of fact, I know I showed you guys that. So we now have a field of view slider, which is pretty cool. And, uh, yeah. And I'm thinking, oh, exact change. Have a good day. Look at this guy. This guy's freaking jacked. He's got protein. This guy's going to be eating that protein. He'll probably eat it raw in the in the car on the way home. Absolute monster. What a beast. Uh, 133. Have a nice day. How's it going, bud? Oh, you got kitties at home? Oh, that's so cute. That's so cute. And have a nice day. There we go. Oh, just keeps going. Uh, one seventy-one fifty. Have a good day. Oh, this guy's this guy's dressed up, man. Where are you going? You got a hot date? Have a nice day. Probably. He's like, don't worry, I'll pick up the booze. Have it going. What's going on, bud? All right, that is looking good. 169.50. Have a nice day. Man, rigging stuff up in this game is so much easier than the, than the place I used to work. We, it was like a bagel store, so we didn't have like a, um, hold on. We didn't have a uh, conveyor, like we didn't have like a, a scan or anything. You just had to like find the thing on the register. So the register was set up like by a madman, AKA my boss. <laughs> <laughs> so that was kind of crazy. Crazy register. All right, we are at 50. We're going to be at $55,000 easy. Let's take a look in the back. We are having a lot of stuff. Um, we should probably get toilet paper and muscle milk. Um, I think the rest of the stuff will probably be okay. Yeah, let's get that stuff. It won't, it won't like break us. We'll, 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 we're going to be doing the, uh, the store uh, expansion next video for sure. Uh, toilet paper. Do these four at a time. Four. Four. Okay. And I just need to wait for the end of the night. Are we almost done? Yeah, we're getting there.
and there we go not too bad i had to actually bring a box out here so you guys get a good view on that um we are running out of stuff that's okay let's see how the day went all right that's not too bad Eleven thousand. beautiful um yogurt and butter yogurt and oh they're right next to each other beautiful uh, let's go with 250 and butter mm, 275 cool all right let's go buy that expansion now where do i think it's going to expand that's it i think it's going to expand right here let's see if i'm right let's see what we got here um growth and purchase we are now poor again yep yep called it nailed it cool so how do i want to how do i want to work with this so i think um we'll just make the booze section kind of bend out over this way that should be pretty good uh we might as well do our settings like this there's the uh, field of view by the way i was talking about earlier i know i mentioned it last episode but not everyone sees everything so let's go ahead and put that right like that right no that's not right no that's awful cage what are you doing supposed to go right there all right and right mm, i can go back a little bit farther it's lined up properly it's just not far enough back Maybe i can't hold on no i think that's about the best i can do all right it is what it is let's go ahead and put the chips over here and now we've got some more room for stuff what am I going to do with it? I'm not sure. I think I'm going to mess with it next. No, nah, I'm going to do it now. Let's see what I want to do over here. There we go. All right, what do I want to put over here? I mean, I have to be shelving, right? Shelving it. I mean, I'm not going to, like, put any freezers over there or fridges. Um, so I could put shelving over here. What would I put on that shelving? I don't know. I really don't know. Uh, you know, I'm not sure if I want to spend money on the shelving either. Because I, you know what? I'm going to save my money. I need money for products. Okay. So we're going to save money for products. And I will put some, it looks like I could fit. Oh man. I'm going to put, what am I going to do up against the window? Somebody was saying in the comment section, why not put the freezers up against the window? That would work. You could put freezers up against the window. The reason I don't do it is because it doesn't like, I, I don't think you would see that in a real store. And plus like the, the sun is beating in on through the window and like, you know, just all over your freezers and like which makes the freezers uh have to run harder and cost you more electricity that's not the way it works in this game but that's that's something i would be thinking about so um yeah i probably won't do that i'm i don't know i don't know what i'm gonna do with the windows over here i might just put shelves up against them i don't really have a better solution uh you know what why don't we just pull back right now i'm curious to see what you guys have to say in the comment section i've got the windows here should i just bite the bullet and put freezers over here i gotta be honest i don't love that idea i really don't should I just put um, shelving up against this window and block the window? I'm, that's kind of what I'm leaning towards. Kind of what I'm leaning towards. I can't wait to read the comments. If you guys ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.